Hey all, Drone Tech here. I am at a pro-life rally here in my own town and there's supposed to be a counter protest. Now, I'm not gonna get into the abortion debate very big, I don't think, but I am gonna ask them all if they agree with Hillary Clinton that all of these pro-life people, Republicans in general, need to be deprogrammed and put into basically re-education camps. It should be interesting to see what they say. What do you think about, uh, do you agree with Hillary Clinton, what she said yesterday? Oh, I didn't hear it. What she said? She said that uh, these people should be put into deprogramming. No, no, I don't that she, government she, mandated. She, she said, she, yeah, she did. She said official deprogramming by the government. Yeah, no, she didn't say that. She did. I guarantee it. You guys are so gullible. At some point, you know, maybe there needs to be a formal deprogramming of the cult members, but something needs to happen. I so she did an interview with. with that. It's ridiculous. She did an interview with Christiana Mangpour yesterday. Okay. All right. All right, I had to stop and get myself a nice beer because I was getting some serious dry mouth talking to that guy. We got a little Saul and Linsky going on over here. Isn't this a little childish, you think? A little Saul Linsky? No. These are grown up. Do you guys agree with these 
tactics? You agree with these tactics? What if right wingers show up to your guys' events and do this? Is that okay? Are you cool with that? Are you alright with that? Hey, are you okay if right wingers show up and do this to you guys? Can right wingers show up to your events and do this to you guys? Yeah? Nobody will get very far though, right? Yeah, it's pretty wild. It's like straight up Saul Alinsky over here. These people are very tight-lipped. They don't want to talk. All they're going to do is, you know, blare their air horns. But yeah, so it's it just kills me because it's like if right-wingers showed up to their events and did this, how would they like it? They wouldn't like it. Right-wingers really should just adopt their tactics. They should. Of course, that would probably be illegal. They'd probably get charged with insurrection or something. All right, I'm gonna get in there, see if I can get anybody to talk to me. I mean, are you at the Gape Church? Is no, no, I'm no? not. I'm not religious okay. at all. No, no. I I don't really agree with abortion, but like, I'm not like against completely banning it, but like. This would put no limits on it, correct? No, it just makes it... What do you mean it puts no limits on it? Well, no limits on, like, when you can do it. Like, up to birth. It, it's up to the doctor and his patient. Who would have an abortion up to birth? Well, that makes no right, sense. Right, I understand it's rare. Who I understand have, it. No, 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 it is never, ever, ever. No, it, it does have. No, 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 it no, does. no. It is a lie okay. made up by Republican politicians. I'll put this in. I'll put like that in Tracy later. Richardson. Okay. Put a biblical ban on oh, abortion for even people who don't agree with your Argue faith. the real facts. Like you guys call killing an unborn baby I gotta, I gotta, healthcare. Okay, talk about real facts. And I'm not religious. I'm not saying that from a religious okay, standpoint. I'm I saying that you're being dishonest when you say that. If you're available. When you say it's healthcare. Or like when you say mutilating children is healthcare. Do you, do you think children uh, have consent to get on puberty blockers? Do you think so? Can you answer? Can men have babies? Can men have periods? Can you guys answer that? How come there's no responsibility for men getting women pregnant? I Don't think there should be. I have four kids. Well, I don't care. Okay, I'm just because saying, like, I would never have an abortion. And, and what about Viagra? You have easy access to that, and you want to take away our contraception. Plus, let's talk about... So you're saying abortion should be used as contraception? Every or? time you masturbate, you're missing the opportunity for children. Why isn't that criminalized? <laughs> let's, we should Regulate, keep it a little bit so you're not, like, you're right there. you ejaculate. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I'm going to put that on a T-shirt. Well, folks, uh, I don't know if anybody's going to really talk to me. There's only a few of them left over there. Uh, I made the mistake of messaging the lady that organized this, and she probably, I don't know, maybe she looked, well, on my profile, there's a link to YouTube and everything, so maybe she saw it. I don't know, but, uh, yeah, nobody's talking. I was going to hang out. And see if maybe somebody, if I can catch them on the sidewalk here, just ask them questions. But they're carrying around that radio, that group of them. They're probably just going to play music where I can't really do anything with it anyway. That dude is with the protesters. That's kind of weird. I felt like he was following me around earlier. She's getting paranoid. I have some thought of weed today. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna, let's go, it's getting cold, I got shorts on, my legs aren't meant for this.
sure if that's from the horns, the music, or the fall. Where in the hell am I? I better take a look around and see if I can get out of here. This place looks really familiar. This place is. These carpets, these lights. I'm not going to say it though because I'm pretty sure it's copyrighted. Yeah, not going down there. Well, I know how this works, so I might as well just find a place to work for now. Not down there. Of course! First I listened to air horns and whistles for two hours. Now I've fallen into what appears to be something like the back rooms. I'll tell you right now, there's no way I'm walking around this place. So I guess I'll just sit right here and watch the media so you don't have to. At least until the end of the month when I'm sure to find a way out of here. Thanks for watching. Make sure to keep checking back to see the latest on what the media is gaslighting the country about. And to check to see if I'm still alive. See you all then.